decided on Jimmy Jam and uh, Terry Lewis as producers for this new album. I thought they were the best new producers in the world. I think maybe there's better producers that have been doing it for 20 years or something, but they'd done the first album that really excited me for ages with a Change of Heart album by Change. I thought that was just brilliant. And did, uh, did they sort of have a very strong influence on how the album developed, or did you find you still... You know, we're telling them what to do. They're the first people to actually produce us, but they're not tough at all. They're real softies, I mean, mm. despite the fact that they're six foot tall and, and like ex-professional footballers and things like that. But no, they're really easy to work with, but they did produce it. In the end, we left them to it. We recorded all the stuff, left them to finish the album off. And did you like that? I mean, it's a certain loss of control, surely. Well, we always try and do whatever anyone thinks we shouldn't do at that stage. You know, people thinking other people writing four songs on the album for the Human League is a ridiculous idea, so we thought we'd do it. Yeah. Mm. Now, you went to Minneapolis. Yeah. Ooh, what's it like? Cold. It, cold. But is it, like, is it like Purple Rain? Yeah, very like Purple Rain. Like, if we went out, we had to go to First Avenue yeah. and so on. Yeah, but it's, it's great. It's so cold there, you know, you die in half an hour. If, if your car stops in winter, you just die in half an hour from heat loss. So everyone's friendly. If you knock on anyone's door, come in, have some soup, and we'll get the police out and things. Wonderful people. Now, um, the new... Uh, you're just about to go on tour. Yeah. Do you find it hard to reproduce what you've got on the albums now that you're having to put together a group? Well, we're not really trying to make it the same as the album. I mean, I think we've been very, very lucky in finding great people for the group who are like... Um, and they're not amateurs at all, but like, uh, Neil came from the local keyboard shop, just wandered along and said, I can do it. <laughs> and then Russell knocked on the door, he's 20, guitarist who's 20, and said, I'm a great guitarist, you want me in your band? What? Go away. But then he, he gets out there and he's doing it, and it's a fantastic band. Now tell me about your nipples. <laughs> well, I did them a few, uh, six or seven years ago, one New Year's Eve. How much did it hurt piercing your own nipples and what did you use before we go to Felix on this high point? Ice and a needle. But this was much worse, doing the top of your ear. It's much more painful. You did the top of your ear? Yeah, that's awful. Are we going to Felix? We're going to Jules. And here he is. Oh, God. Oh, blow me. We're on so soon.